again out at Charles City County, Virginia to Harrison Lake National Fish Hatchery. So, first day of 2019. I thought I'd come down here and me and Bear are going to do a, a, little, uh, a little hike back here on these nature trails. A couple of them I didn't do, which was the dike and the short trail right there. We did the whole loop of this thing here a while back and I posted a video of it but I never did the dike trail or the short trail as you see there so we're gonna go back here and check these out and then when we come back I think I'm gonna go and we're gonna go down this trail right here to the uh, to the lake trail to the lake I've fished in the lake quite a few times in the past but uh, I'm gonna uh, check that trail out so we're off on a little adventure here today to clear up a little bit but it doesn't really look like it is so um and i'm checking out my new camera here today too this is a a new canon eos 80d so uh, check out some of the picture capabilities and the video capabilities here today so there's the first little video i've shot out here with it so come along at uh, Harrison Lake National Fish Hatchery, the nature trails they have out here. And here we are walking along Heron Creek here. Pretty peaceful little trail they got coming down through here. Uh, place like I said last time on other videos that I never really um never really knew they had these trails back here uh, uh, we're checking them out today piece of little creek here you can see off there in the background that's where all the raring ponds are you know I knew about all that but I didn't know these uh didn't know these trails were back here so we're gonna check out a couple of them we didn't hit last time I did the big whole loop but we're going to go check out the, the dike trail and the short trail. A little cut through. And do that little section. So, uh, anyway. As I say, it's a beautiful little, beautiful little creek. Heron Creek that flows down through here. And, uh, as you can see, the water picks up pace and falls over some little spots here. And you can see it kind of running through there. You'll have to excuse me some of this footage. I'm trying out this new camera today. See how it does on video out here on the trail. And I'll probably revert back to just using my iPhone for video, but I just thought I'd try a little bit of this today. And of course, mainly this camera is for taking pictures, but I thought I'd check out the video capabilities of it today. So anyway, a little bit of footage along the creek. I think Bear's getting into whatever he can get into. <laughs> you having fun there, boy? A little shot of the creek here. It winds its way through this little area here. Last time I was standing on the, that gravel bed right there. Water's up a little bit now. We got a decent little bit of rain there yesterday. So, so anyway, little shots of the creek flowing through here. As you see, it picks up pace in some little areas. So, uh, Heron Creek. Some nature trails down here at uh, Harrison Lake National Fish Hatchery. Me and Bear are going to check out a couple of trails we didn't hit before. So here we are at the Dyke Trail. So we're going to shoot across and head back towards the creek. be interesting you kind of high up off the rest of the terrain here on this dike so as you can see a tree is falling over here which ain't much of a problem looks like I got most of it kind of cut out so you can get through it so, um, yeah looks pretty cool up here so far 
see if, how bear does getting across this tree. You wanna come across it, boy? There you go. Good boy. Good boy. That right, little bear, huh? You're a good boy. <laughs> so the dike trail here. Kind of cool looking up here. Overlooking the little swampy areas down in here. Like we got a some water movement down there, probably a couple ducks. So the dike trail. Here we are. My fellow YouTuber Smelling Roses said in my last video of this place that he'd like to see what it looks like from the dike trail. So I'm here doing it today. So here you go, Smelling Roses. This is about midway through it, I reckon. Coming through the dike trail. As you can see, we're up above the little swampy areas. Bears having him a good little time out here. They got little benches sitting around here in places, as you can see. It's, uh, some nice views right here from this little bench. So, uh, you can see the swamp through here. We're heading back towards the creek. The Dyke Trail. So pretty much, it's a very short little trail. That's where the long trail comes through. Um, then made it back here to the little spot overlooking the Heron Creek and all. Water swift through this little section here. You can see. But, uh, Heron Creek. In Charles City, Virginia. This is part of the National Wildlife Service's uh, Harrison Lake National Fish Hatchery. Some trails they got all through here. So, uh, just checked out a couple little sections I hadn't been on before. Me and Bear are going to go take the exit back out of here in a second. We're going to go. Uh, Check out the trail that goes to the lake along the creek. So hang with us and that'll be next. In the creek right here. Thought I'd shoot a little a couple little shots of it. It's flowing down through here pretty good. Sandy little area there. So me and Bear have arrived at the end of the trail here. It comes from the hatchery down to the to the actual fishing lake. All them little ponds at the hatchery you can't fish at, but you can fish at this one here. They've got the road closed off for the winter. It's got a sign there that says uh, you can check in during the weekly, you know, normal open hours, I guess. Um, maybe they'll let you down here. I don't really know, but as you can see, there's, there's the dam and all at the Harrison Lake. That lake's got some nice fish in it. I've fished in there before. And uh, so anyway, I've been always wanting to check out that trail. So now I know where it comes out up down here at, that little gate right there. So uh, we'll probably just walk back up the road there to the, where we parked and all, a little easier. The trail, different view. I drove down the road, I ain't never walked it, so I'll probably walk down the road. Me and Bear checking everything out here on the first day of the year. First little hike of 2019. I'm kind of glad to put 2018 behind me. I had a lot of things happen in my life that I kind of wish would have never happened. My mama died there on Christmas Eve. I lost my beloved buck, my yellow lab. Back this summer, I've had back and foot problems which I seem to have finally got some medication that eases some of that especially my foot I think that led to a lot of the back problems to be honest with you but <clears throat> got a cortisone shot and all in it and 
tried some different things in my shoes and seemed to have got all that, like I say, worked out. It still bothers me a little, but I can deal with it a little. But here we are at Harrison Lake. Let's say we just left the fish hatchery part in the earlier parts of the video. So uh, there you have it, folks. First day of January, January 1st, 2019. Me and my little buddy Bear, he's replaced my boy Buck. He looks like he's gonna be a good one. I already loved the little buddy. He's growing up pretty big. Ain't, ain't even six months old yet. He's a whopper already. Ain't that right, good boy? Say hi to everybody, Bear. Hey, boy. Say hi to everybody. A beautiful little boy. So here we are, coming to the end. Ain't that right, Bear? Coming back out here to the main area where the hatchery is and all the buildings and all for the fish hatchery. So we're going to pack it in for the day. A little hike we did on the first day of the year here. January 1st, 2019. Me and my buddy, me and my buddy Bear, we had a good little time out here today. We'll head on back, maybe watch a little college football today. Back to the grind at work after this. No more days off. Even got me working the weekend, it looks like, coming up. Oh well, like I say, back to the grind. So here we are, as you see, Harrison Lake National Fish Hatchery. So uh, we're going to call it a day, folks. Thanks for coming along. Me and me and my buddy Bear enjoyed it. 